So behind me is the Nissan Blade Glider concept car, an all-electric concept um, that we're studying for potential future production. Uh, the vehicle really demonstrates how you can take electric vehicle technology and put it into different shapes and, and really design the car around what you want it to be. So the car has a unique one plus two configuration, so the driver sits alone while two passengers behind. Uh, it has a narrow front wing, uh, or front, sorry, narrow front track, so about a one meter track in front. Um, and then a wider rear. Uh, it's about a 70% uh, weight ratio over the rear tires. Uh, so what that gives you is extremely, uh, extremely good dynamic handling. My name is Daryl Harrison from Volkswagen of America, and what you have here is the 2015 Volkswagen e-Golf, Volkswagen's first introduction into the full electric uh, market here in the United States. The e-Golf goes on sale later this year. It offers a range of 70 to 90 miles in real-world driving, but it also gives you the flexibility of being able to adjust driver profiles and regeneration modes so that you can actually get even more range out of the car. In addition to that, the e-Golf actually offers the most interior space and most rear seat legroom of any compact EV available today. Um, it actually has the same amount of interior space as every Golf product that's available from the diesel to the gas, uh, etc.